Nice it's such a side hair. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Vanessa and I have an obsession with matte eyeshadows. Yes, matte, not shimmer. I know so many people are all geeky about shimmer, but for me, a good matte is what really gets me. Like, if I can blend four or five of a different brand together and you can actually see the differences, it tells me something and that's what I geek out over. So today, I'm going to do part one of my Davina matte eyeshadows. I have the shimmer side on this side and then um, when I do the shimmers, I will also share with you guys some of the highlighters. So I did a mini haul because she had a special 35% off for Mother's Day and I'm a mom, so I took care of me. And I'm just gonna go through and share some of the mattes that I have and uh, the next video we will do the shimmers. So starting out with Capri, I love this one. Her um, mattes, even the pastel -y colors, they're just, they're so much fun and, and I enjoy them and they blend nicely. So even if a matte is a little bit chalky because it's a, you know, a pastel, they still can build up beautifully. So this is Capri. This one right here is Anastasia or Anastasia. I'm not sure how she wants that pronounced. And right here is Courtney. This is that beautiful baby puke kind of uh, color that looks amazing in the crease. Oh, by the way, I've been looking for a dupe forever for the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Honey Palette, that kind of yellow shade. Capri is it, man. And you don't have to buy the whole palette if you don't want to. Uh, this is Nevea. I would say Nevea. She has some interesting names, too. And it's a pretty orange kind of color. A little bit deeper than this one. This is Sura. Mm, Alithia, Alithia. Sorry girl, if you watch my video and you're like, man, you butchered those names, but you didn't exactly make it easy. Isn't that pretty? Uh, this one is Lucretia. It's a pinky one. Mmm. Cats and Heat. This is Fenella. Fenella. Okay. This one is Penelope. I use this as my transition shade into blend today. It's very creamy. A little bit of kick up to it, but to me, you know, you tap off your brush and then you know that you've got an amazing pigmented eyeshadow. It's like you don't care. I care, I don't know what to tell you. They're, they're that good. This is Push. Her pastels remind me of what I wished the Lorac pastel palette would have been. That lunch one? Yes, I have the lunch one. Like if you were someone that didn't get the pastel goth palette, you could just pick up some of her pastels and you'd be solid. Viridian. My living room is clean. Now we've got Jaded. Desma. This is like a plummy, plummy color. It's kind of got that brown base to it, so you could use it for like a smoky eye. This one is Aria. This is Candy. What is it? Your mom. Candy. This one is Crexus. Lighting on the side is not as good for my skin. She's not here to look at me. And this one is Passion. This is my favorite. This is in my outer V and a little in my crease. If you pick up one shade from Davina Cosmetics, it's Passion. You need it. Everyone needs a little passion in their life, right? 
This one is Nemesis. I guess it's got some of that hue to it. More of a burgundy back here. But up here, looks purple. Back here, looks burgundy. This is Bambi. Adorn. And the last one is Manic. I mean, look at this, you guys. And we're out there buying palettes from companies that give us substandard matte shades. We're like, oh, two are good, so it's okay. But no, that's why I am all about the indies right now. Because this, and they blend. They're good. I just want her to make more matte shades. Like, I need 15 variations of this brown and four variations of this yellow, you know what I'm saying? But I just love, love the way that they perform. I love how beautiful they are, how pigmented they are. They blend really well. I am 150% sold on all of her products. I know she just came out with some bronzers. I haven't gotten any of those yet. I've been slowly just working on my collection, uh, filling up on the mattes and then working my way into shimmers. And when I ordered, I must have been on a blue red kick because that's like all I ordered. I don't know what I was thinking. So next edition of Davina Cosmetics will definitely be the shimmers, and then I will also share with you guys some of the highlighters that I have. Thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in more swatches, you can always check out my girl, Angela Mary Tanner on Instagram. She has a uh, amazing blog that has every single shade on there. And that is our beauty cult, and they also have the affiliate code. So if you're interested, check them out. As always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I am wearing some of these today on my lids. You'll have to watch that video, okay? It's on Thursday. Why? This is makeup game. Oh, swatch crew. This would be a cool tattoo. I would tattoo this. Like, what is that? My swatches? I'm done now. <laughs>